Happy Marketing Monday, everyone. If you're a part of eCar, you may already know of the email system they've established that allows you to send listing information, open houses, and more through Google Groups to fellow agents in the area. Today, I'm gonna to show you how you can join the groups if you aren't already subscribed and how you can use templated marketing materials for promotion to the groups. Okay, let's get started on subscribing to the Google Groups. So first things first, you'll want to hop on to emeraldcoastrealtors.com. Under MLS support, you'll scroll down to eCar email service. Once you land here, you'll see that there are rules to subscribing and unsubscribing to the groups, and then links to subscribe to each of the area Google Groups here. What you'll need to do is click on the area that you wish to subscribe to. If you'd like to do all of them or several, um, you'll just have to do this a couple of times, but it's super quick and easy. So you'll click on the link and you will in the subject line of an email, you'll compose an email to eCar um, Google Group and then include your name and eCar ID in the subject line of the email. Um, once you do that, they will send a confirmation email where you will have to follow a couple more prompts. Um, but once you do that, you will be confirmed and subscribed to each of the Google groups that you choose. There are a few more um, rules and information on sending emails, responding, and then some group descriptions on each of the area groups, um, their emails, and um, where those areas are located. You do want to keep in mind that you should only be sending emails um, about listings in the specific area that they are listed in. Um, that sounds a little confusing, but basically if you have area 14 listing in Destin, you won't be sending it in area 17. Um, but now that we have gone here, let's hop over into um, some automated marketing centers just to look at how we can dress up some of the emails that we're sending to the Google groups. So I'm on beachminute.com right now. I'm going to log in just because this is where our hub of resources are. And I'm going to use Resource Center as my example today. Um, I'm doing this because there are an abundance of materials in Resource Center that you can use for this purpose. So you'll click on Resource Center. And let's go ahead and log in here. Again, you can use um, the marketing center of your choice, whether that's Resource Center, Moxie, Impress, something else you use. Um, but this is what I'm going to use today just to kind of show you all what's inside. So once we're logged in, we're going to go to Marketing Resource, Market a Property. And you'll see there are just listed, just sold, open house. There are social graphics, um, brochures, e-cards, flyers, the whole nine. So I'm going to do an open house graphic um, for this example. So I'll click on the template. And something to keep in mind, if we're wanting to send an email out to the e-card Google groups, uh, Including something like this is best in the message body of the email and not as an attachment because um, we want to get their attention quickly. So um, the social graphics in Resource Center, those are going to be PNG or JPEG files versus attaching a PDF. Um, so just keep that in mind, but we can go ahead and get started. Name the template, open house and get to customizing. So from here, you'll notice that there will be green check marks on areas in the template that don't need to be edited. And then these little yellow exclamation points are gonna tell you what needs to change. So obviously we've got some pictures and dates to change on this. Um, one way you can do this is by clicking into these details and replacing or removing them by uploading an image from your desktop. Um, but for this example, I'm going to go ahead and choose a property using the um, MLS search or available listings from our company. So I'm going to click out of there and hit choose property. All right, you can click show all company listings to view all of our listings, and I'm just going to use this one right here as an example. So you'll click in. Once you do that, it's going to pull in all of the details from the listing into the graphic. 
So you can see the first few photos were chosen, and the only thing we need to edit now is the date for the open house. So click in here, December. I'll do it for December 10th and choose 12 to 4. Once you do that, you'll notice it's saving changes and there's a green check mark here. So once that is done, you'll use this little download button here. Click download. And now we can pull this PNG file here into the message body of an email to the Google Groups. And this can go for anything. Um, if you're a part of another MLS and you don't have access to these Google Groups, um, this is just a great way to learn how you can dress up an email or use the social graphics or anything really that's um, found within Resource Center. So let's get back to it. I am going to compose an email to the ECAR Area 17 Google Group. Um, it's recognizing what I've previously done in here, um, but just using those um, those associated email addresses in the recipient line is what's going to send to everyone subscribed to that group. Say open house um, Saturday. However, you want to do this. Go ahead. Um, we'll just say we include that and then let's drag over the open house graphic. So I'm just going to take this and grab it from my file. It was in my recent, whatever that looks like for you. Just drop it into the email. Um, and for some, at this point, you might see um, this might come in as an attachment originally. All you'll have to do is click on it. And um, in other platforms, you, you might have a drop down arrow where you can see move image to message body. That's what you'll want to do here. Um, but in this example, I just dragged it over. So it came in a little big. Obviously, my um, email signature is pretty small here. So if you want to shrink it down, you can use this cursor. Click. And just drag this in to be a little bit more reasonable sizing. Um, and then if you want to hyperlink this image so that they can be taken to the Flex MLS link by clicking on the image, you could just click, do insert link insert hyperlink and you'll drop in um, the flex MLS or website link wherever you want to take them here. You can also if you want to include any text or information above the graphic, you can just kind of. Oh, should be able to press enter a couple times and type here. Include links, anything you want to put above the graphic, but this just makes it look professional, dressed up, gets their attention super quickly um, with your details there at the bottom. So again, this can be used for whether you're doing this to the eCar Google Groups, which is super nice and easy. If you don't have that ability, this is a great way to just look professional in your email on social media. Um, you can do a lot of things with these graphics. So if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. Um, but this is how you send an email to the eCar Google Groups. Thanks for watching. I hope this video was helpful. See y'all next Marketing Monday.